Step one, review the data and plan the analysis. Before you can perform any intelligent statistical analysis on a data set, you must first understand the data. Data sets are typically arranged in a rectangular array, as you see here, where each column corresponds to a variable, each row corresponds to an observation, or sometimes called a case, and variable names are usually listed in the top row. In this data set, each row has information about a bank employee, and the variables provide information about the employees. Variables are either categorical or numeric. In this data set, gender is clearly categorical because it contains text. With categorical variables, it is often a good idea to create 0, 1, or dummy variables. This has been done in column D, where an if function has been used to record 1 for females and 0 for males. The variables age, years of experience, and salary are numeric. Generally, you perform different types of analysis on categorical variables than on numeric variables, so you should make sure you understand which is which. By the way, the variable employee in column B is simply an index, so you are unlikely to include it in any statistical analysis. Next, you should plan the overall analysis. What do you want to learn about this bank data? You might want to study the variables one at a time. For example, you might want to know the breakdown of males versus females, the average age of all employees, or the distribution of salaries. You might then want to explore relationships between the variables. For example, you might want to know whether males tend to have more years of experience than females, or you might want to explore whether older employees make higher salaries than younger employees. You might then want to involve all of the variables in a regression analysis to see whether females make lower salaries than males after controlling for age and years of experience. Obviously, there is not one single right answer on how to analyze such a data set. However, the questions you ask lead naturally to the types of stat tools procedures you will employ, so you should take time to formulate good questions. Now it's your turn. Take a quick look at the data in this data set. Are there any missing data, that is blanks? Do there appear to be any data values that are, quote, wrong, that is, out of the ordinary? Actually, this data set is clean, but these are the types of questions you should ask about real data sets before you dive in.